once we do all of this work, the third thing, and this is where we get kind of into the big picture, the big, you know, picture of what this is all about, is we've got to release whatever meaning, and I'm talking to myself too, uh, that we've applied to this election. Because when you take it in the context that I'm talking about, soul growth, keeping our flame alive, serving our life mission, uh, um, following our passion, it's much bigger than this election. And whatever those issues are, healing, growth, passion, they're going to be here on November 4th, regardless of the outcome. So once we're doing that work of what is important to me and what is my flame and what am I here to do and how can I heal, how can I hone my gift, um, it's bigger than November 3rd. We are here on this planet to do some serious work. And each of us does that individually. It's not my job to change my neighbor. It's not my job to do their work. I couldn't if I tried, and I have tried. <laughs> it just doesn't work. There's, <laughs> we, we, it comes from inside. And here we are on this cusp of the age of Aquarius, and we're feeling the, 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 the monumental energetic shift in ages and we're here as souls called to this earth at this time none of this is coincidence so the goal is equanimity um you know win or lose we're here to do the work we're here to help heal um and there's opportunity in it so um you know, back to the 2016 election, which was very traumatic for me and probably others. So I don't want to go into the details of the pain I felt <laughs> when I woke up the next morning. Uh, but I learned a lot and it changed my path a lot. And it clarified some ways that I was showing up that were not productive. And it gave me the opportunity to go in to um, places and listen to people I wasn't listening to before. And ultimately it's healed me in ways I didn't imagine. And so it's ugly. I mean, there is some real suffering here right now and it's hard to watch and, and it's karma working out. It's working out individually for each of us and it's working out in front of us. And, and we who are empathetic, feel that suffering and we feel that pain but this is the work this is the um, breadcrumb trail that we're following um, to wholeness well we all have we all have something that called us here to do and each of us has to figure that out and that's the flame that's that internal piece of wisdom that we just keep returning to so in that way I find hope. I, I find opportunity in all of this. Yes, there's work. Wow. But it's also opportunity. 